Hello, everybody. <clears throat> and here we go to Glacio. Ah, you know what? I think I'll make that the title name if I remember. <laughs> I'm jumping in. I'm jumping in that. I think uh, my friend is going to jump in or um, watch. Or not. Maybe he's going to sleep. Alrighty. So here we go. Here we go to Glacio, as I say. Um, just doing a last minute check. Check, we got the soil centrifuge, we got the landing pad. Medium printer, small printer, oxygenator. I have the three compounds for the large printer. I've got the medium platform and the medium wind turbine and a battery. <clears throat> plus three more resin for another large thing. So. And away we go. Calidor, Atrox. Where are you? There you are. Glacio. We've got to get some iron. Is that right next to? <laughs> Looks as good as any. Let's hit it. was a whoops. Um, <laughs> yeah, we're gonna... <clears throat> that was a whoops. I hit the V button rather than... Uh... What well, sent me back to orbit? Okay, so that's fine. I'm gonna speed this along so we get back to the launching area we were at. Damn! I was afraid I was going to do that at least once. Um, I did like that launching place that we were at, so... Okay, because I saw all that crap. Okay, so, let's make sure. Oh, I must hit C, launch into orbit. Okay, that's alright. We've got a whole bunch of iron right there. We have a whole bunch of grife? Yeah, gree wah. You'll have to excuse me. I apparently suffered a stroke while I was in the middle of talking. Um, graphite at like a ton. So, um, so that's good because um, a lot of research, as I said, research is very good. Hi, space fighter. Um, how are you? Good. Do you fight space? <laughs> Do you punch space until it surrenders? Or do you like piloting space fighters? Okay. 
you know, I may actually set up shop right here. Yeah, I think I'll set up shop right here. This is uh, pretty much as flat as we would hope. We've got research right next to us and exocache. I think this is a perfect place. And it gives us a bird's eye view. Oh, there's that honk honk horn down there. So, let's do this. Um, first thing coming out of here is the oxygen aid. Oh no, first thing coming out of here is the landing pad. Um, yeah. Rotate that. We are at a slight angle, but you know what? I will, uh, I will accept that, because this gives us another chance to auto-arm research. So, um, so, there's that. We got a medium platform. The oxygenator. Um, I'm gonna ask for Christmas. I thought maybe get a name that would go with it, because I was going to stream it a lot. Oh, space fighter! Ha <laughs> ha! Very nice. Very nice. that I do have to put the medium printer here. Put the there we go. And we're close enough to the like I can I can see the thing from anywhere, so we're close enough for me to easily go over there and activate one and actually build the base here. Um button again. I really need to... While we're waiting for that to make a large platform B. This. Back this. Printer. Oh, that's right. I need to forward progress. I don't know if a buggy would be a good idea. I'm gonna grab a medium generator. Oh, research. Oh, that's right. It always researches. I always, I think it. I always think it gives me a medium generator whenever I see that mission. Oh. Hold on a second. Hey, Linda, what's up?
right, and we are back. Sorry, took a phone call from somebody. Um, back that. And I do think what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave a little room. I'm going to move that to here. And I'm going to leave a little room next to here for when I do actually start putting shelters. what time it is everybody cat cam time <laughs> starring our very large pudding any winners a can of cat he is um <laughs> He is uh, close to 18 pounds, if I remember correctly. So he used to be 20. He did lose a little weight. Let me pick that up and rotate it. There we go. He did lose a little bit of weight, so. Put that down. Whoops. It's interesting how it flips. Did you notice that the front of it tucks like that? But it flips. <laughs> it fizzes around. Flips around, man. Um, and actually, I do think... Oh, yeah, I should have enough room back here for, uh, for our power, power area. Um, I'm going to grab this, and I'm going to put it here. And that will give this the ability to make another one of those. We got the tungsten and the carbon. I'm gonna ask for here for Christmas, eh? That should be fun. I really, this is a fun game. Um, I'll tell you if you haven't actually gone to my YouTube page and watched the stream from the beginning, make sure to make multiple copies of your save. Like one of the save files. What is this? Forward progress. Oh. Um, one of. Two of my save, the save file and the backup both corrupted, so I was unable to load them. Now, again, I am using a couple mods, but I'm only using four. And they shouldn't be anything so drastic that the whole game collapses in on itself, so. But, you know what? I'm putting that up. That'll provide at least a little bit of power right now until we build the large. I'm going to put you back here. That'll give... It's a good game. You know, if they'd hammer out some of the bugs, it would be a perfect game. <laughs> but that's that's about a lot of games at this point. There we go. Soil centrifuge. And I'll always tell you, make sure you take or have the ability to build a soil centrifuge on any planet. Because the soil centrifuge when you put these little um, canisters on the side of your thing, I'm playing on PS4. Oh, okay. So yeah, you you should have. When you put the canister on, when you fill them up with soil, you can put them in here to get your basic materials, so you don't have to constantly go out looking for resin and or and compound, because those are the most common things you need to build. So if you have something that can produce them. And you're, you don't even need to necessarily be digging to fill. Most of the time, um, um, most of the time you're just doing it anyway. You're just digging to, you know, for whatever you need to dig for. And then that way you'll have a, um, you know, you'll have a way to do what you need to, to get resources without having to find them. Now I happen to have some over here, so I'm, I'm very... I'm glad of that because I do need to make I do need to make um <laughs> if 
I do need to make a... Uh... There we go. And what I'm gonna do is get another large platform B. Get one resin, which I'm just gonna store. Large platform is going to be our energy platform, and that allow me to take this wind thing off of here and put the large printer on it. Yeah, it can certainly be a fun game. Like, if it wasn't, uh, that's just, I am just saddened by the, uh, by the save game issue. I just, that saddens me. Otherwise, it'd be easily one of my favorite games to play. If it wasn't not knowing if I'm going to have to restart my stream for the 14th time because both my save and its backup decide that they're just not going to work anymore. <laughs> like... Hmm. Um... Got nothing over here, eh? Usually... Usually those have something. So chest. Oh, there we go. That. That open. Here you, Jim, send me the Twitch. Um, it's actually linked. Hey. Thank you. It's actually linked in on my main Twitch page. Um. And you're welcome to check it out. I'm gonna move the battery and I'm actually gonna put this over here. Yep, you're absolutely welcome to check it out. I can put, um, give me a second, I can, uh, I'll, I'll actually copy. I'll actually put it right here for you. Play text, chat. I think that should take you to my page. It takes me to my page. Yeah, I think that should take you to my page. And you're welcome to, welcome to stop on by and say hello. Yeah, no problem. Huge thing gonna go away. Um, okay, so. You know what? I will actually get the buggy. Because I do want to be able to breathe. <laughs> Yay! Yep, and so uh, as you can see I've I've played uh I've played a lot of this game. <laughs> And then the next thing I want to get is um, a research center. So I'm going to, what I'm going to do is I'm going to take my buggy down to where we came from. Now there's compound and here's resin right here. Um, I don't believe so. I was discussing it with another person who was um, in chat, and they said that they were having trouble finding people to play with because of um, everybody was playing on a different console. So I don't think it is cross-platform. And I am using the PC version if you were to uh, talk about playing multiplayer. Yeah, sorry. Okay, so... You know what? I think I may actually make this my, um, I'm gonna make this my quarry, because I think, uh, I think that's steep enough where, um, good friends are. Good, 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 yeah. Glad at that. Mm. Okay. 
But that also means that I do want to first of all take the crap. I do want to get compound too. All right, so ooh, I actually almost filled. Um, I almost filled my. There we go. Now both of those are full. Now I can start. Ah. Drive the buggy back to my base all of two feet because I'm lazy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Said, it's a fun game. Um, I'm not sorry that I got it, despite all the problems that I've been having for years with this game. I'm not sorry that I got the game. the end of power, but I do have an RTG with me, so. I'm going to utilize that, and I'm also going to utilize this to make tethers. I'm going to utilize both of these to make tethers, because I'm going to have to tether. Um, some more. relatively relaxed game. Um, I have died a couple times, but uh, um, each of the deaths have been... I, I did something I knew that I shouldn't have done. <laughs> and sure enough, I proved to myself why I shouldn't have done it, or, you know, the deaths aren't unfair. So, uh... Oh, 
trusty crew. Oh! There's FM. Hello. Thank you for joining me again. We do have the kitty cam up and running. <laughs> the cat cam. Although he's, he's sleepy more than, uh... <laughs> what? What? What did you want me to say? I said welcome and thank you. You millennials are just sensitive. <laughs> I'm so upset that I'm here. <laughs> No, what happened was I was I was trying to figure out who I agree was and why this wasn't their first text in chat. And then I remembered that I had seen your username on Steam before. And that's why I was like, uh, oh. <laughs> that's, that's who that is. appreciative when someone joins. Especially since there's so many things people can do with their time off. It's nice, uh, nice that you've decided to join me here and mine. I don't know how deep I'm going to have to go. Oh, oh, I think we just found out. Especially when it makes that crinkling noise, is usually when it makes that crinkly. Yeah, there she is. There's the cavern. No, I just didn't know who you were at front. I didn't know who you were at first. And there's the cavern. back up. I should have dropped off my soil earlier, but I hate the ground. It looks like it's about to hit me in the head. I should have been managing my soil. Stopping by. So, FM, what are you doing? Other than watching me. Bye. Bye, Space Fighter. Did you have to mute me again because you're playing the Valeria, whatever what that other game is? Um, 
and then actually, you know what? Why don't we do this? Pick that one up. Three. Have you make a bigger one. Two. Two. Gonna have you keep making storage. Buggy up, back that buggy up. Right, Mindy, how are you? Good to see you again. Oh, that's right. I don't want to fall to my death. I forgot that uh, I am splendid. I'm now on Glacio. I need iron. And actually, there's a ton of it um, where I landed, but you know me. <laughs> I gotta set the whole base up before I get any of it. is way steeper than I normally do. I hope I don't slide right to my death just because of how steep this is. Oh hey, a little resin cave. And we need more of that. And we need more soil. is um anytime you're ready oh titanium oh i need that too oh crap i'm balloon thingy all right and i'm gonna take this okay so i'm gonna 
Um, you know, what we're gonna do is actually um, go all the way down here with this. Don't, 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 just don't. Don't do your crazy crap. Fill up on soil and get a bunch of this. If you walk side diagonally or sideways, you can uh, go faster up hills. Uh, usually steep hills. You got yours up and running, eh? Right, Minty? Did you? Uh... Oh, dang it! I need to fix that right now. Um, did you? What was I just about to say? <laughs> you start a new world then. Although, I don't think that was actually the question... Oh, dear. I don't think that was actually the question I was going to ask. That just came out of my head. <laughs> it's a <new> world, too. <laughs> like, of course you started a new world. Don't mind me. I'm derpy. Um... That's right, you said it had been years since you had played. New World and you can't find Compound. You know, start digging straight down. Um, uh, not straight down, but like angle like I do. Make a make a quarry because oftentimes you find it underground too. And it might be underneath your base. I should have saved some of that resin because I'm pretty sure I need it for my forge. Which is the next thing that I'm putting up. No compound. Oh my god. On rare opportunities if we had we'd have we had to run for a distance. gods are not kind to you is what that means. <laughs> um, Time for smelter. Condenser chemistry lab. Soil. Resident compound. Yep, I knew I should have uh, <laughs> saved one of those things as well. Oh, but there is compound nearby too. Why have you not started? Starting. Ooh, 4,000. That is a lot of... Do I have ceramic? No, that's tungsten. I don't have ceramic yet. Um, unfortunately, I'm going to have to take this RTG. Because I need to... I need to attach it to the side of the car, so I just run out of things. Down here. Oh, that's the right there. Is it down here? Oh, there's iron down there too. And I need to get a bunch of this. tractor from the missions, right? Wait, how did you... Did you start with, like, zero compound, or did you start with a little bit? What did I 
Does the mission with the tractor not require any compound? I can't remember. Um, you know what? Here's here's this too. I'm gonna grab a little bit of that. Okay. This is filling, why would this be filling that? What is nice is, um, what is nice is since, um, where was all the compound hiding? an entire mountain of just compound. <laughs> I would not put it past that thing, trust me. Wait, how did I make a medium shredder? Did I find two iron and decided to waste my time on that garbage? <laughs> I'm a little bit mad at myself. If I'd have found that if I'd have thought about it, I would have kept that iron and used it on the, um... Hold on. Used it on an atmospheric processor. I wouldn't have had to... Well, whatever. Um, oh no, as I was saying, what's nice is now that I'm on a planet that has... Or that I can start making clay... Small wind turbines take ceramic. Here we go. Yeah, 
just about to solve a lot of issues. And um, one of them being is I no longer need to use... Why did all the light shut off just for a second? I no longer need to use the RTG. I can attach that, and since the wind kicks up pretty regularly... Well, the wind's blowing, then it does this when the wind stops. <laughs> I'm gonna go play it. Okay. Alrighty, you have a good one. doing that thing where he looks around but his eyes are still closed. Plastic. Okay, so I do need one of those. That. Um, this. That. Mm. Mm, my little rover and I. We should not have parked in the middle of my city. I'm gonna go all the way down here to where that stupid Balloomba thing is. I'm going to get some iron. Boom, boom. Yeah, boom. <laughs> Ow. Let's replant that. I don't know if that becomes friendly or not. Okay, so. Oh, you want to see something that the developers think is cute but is actually terrifying? Uh, let me show you. Use. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I could drive over that.
harvest, as you can see. Bring the buggy with us. Now, the other thing to keep an eye out for is there's a cat up, cat of something or another, cat a pot or whatever, um, and it throws, it throws explosive things at you, and you can actually, um, you can utilize that by, um, putting exo caches near where you're standing and then you run away as it throws it and it'll actually break the exo cache open for you. Read the book. That was something interesting. <laughs> I was about to say we don't need no roads. But guess what? <laughs> we might need a better road than the one that I built. <laughs> oh Well, hello, Sudzy. Hello again, FM. Uh, this is actually a single-player game. Um, no, no, let me let me clarify that because I was confusing somebody else. I'm actually streaming a single-player game, um, so I do want to play this one by myself. But. Um, I know that there was a gentleman who is, he's changing his ID so that he, because he wants to multiplay. No. I know, I know, I know that I can, but at this point in time, <laughs> I just have not had a chance, nor am I able to easily keep up with multiple worlds. I thought I had told you this before, I've had. <laughs> like, I, can't, I don't play on multiple Minecraft servers because I, I can't keep up. And I want to I want to single player this world, old man energy is the truth. There have been a couple other people that have chatted that are looking for someone to play with. Sudzy, what platform are you playing on? That's the big important part. PC. Okay. Um, what I'm going to do is I know there's somebody else who is looking to play multiplayer, and at this juncture, I'm just not, um, I'm just bored. <laughs> I mean, uh, actually, I haven't seen him in chat. Usually, I see him pretty much every day. He jumps on pretty much immediately, but, uh, <laughs> If I see him, I will uh, let you know. Six, seven, okay. I'll let him know and he can reach out to you. I have... Yeah, that's him. Yep, that's him. 
he uh, he's he's gonna change his idea. I told him that um, I'm not against playing multiplayer for multiplayer, but he's gonna have to change his ID because I can't be, you know, Fields of Zen, PG, and all that. He's from New Zealand. <laughs> yeah, he's from New Zealand, so, uh, wait, why is this thing making another? Why am I making another? I accidentally... Why am I making another large, one of these large platforms? I mean, in actuality, he was talking about um, veal and things like that, baby animals. But I told him that I did not care, because that's just gross. <laughs> so, I said uh, that we... <laughs> that he was, he's going to still need to uh, change, his, change his ID. I, uh, I've never had it. Oh, that's right. We need to look at plastic. Compound and carbon. Okay. There's carbon. I have to bring a carbon with me. That's cool. And, uh, iron, glass, and plastic. Okay, so I do need to... Oh! Glass. I've never had veal. I I don't generally stray from uh, from a limited from a limited option. Um, okay, I guess you know what? I guess we're gonna put this back here. It's not bad. I usually stick with hamburger, cheese, or uh, ha hamburger, cheeseburger. Yeah, those are not actually two different things. Um, hamburger, like beef, pork, chicken, fish. Like that's that's usually what I stick to, and I stick to the normal. Like I'm not doing pickled pig feet and all that other stuff. I just stick to you know bologna, ham, bacon. make argon, I think. Um, whoops. <coughs> um, let me see. Carbine is tungsten and carbon. Okay. Graphene is graphite and hydrazine. Graphene and graphene. Hydrazine is hydrogen, ammonium, and ammonium. Silicon requires methane, as well as spotter sulfur. Steel requires argon. Okay. I I need. Um, this thing draws 20 US, though. 20 US when it's powered. Okay. Well, let me see. What is the 
Field shelter, silicon, and graphene. Auto arm is aluminum and... So a trade platform is exochip, iron, and tungsten. Okay, I am gonna get that, and I'm gonna get exochip, steel, tungsten, carbide, and rubber. The auto extractor, that's also important. Extra large shredder um, is also important. Extra large platform A. Extra large platform C requires two resin, two resin, and two iron. We can actually wait. We can actually get the RTG, nanocarbon alloy, and lithium. Holy crap! That's gonna be uh, forever, but I am going to get it. Okay. So here, I want to come home with three of these full of this and titanium. So I am going, and we go down. See, that's what I was afraid of. <laughs> um, so, <laughs> step one, get our body. <laughs> step two, make that angle not so sharp. You know, that's what happens. This guy likes to skate everywhere. And that's what happens if your angle is too sharp. You'll actually hit it as if you're uh, falling. So. Stop that. Okay. No, that's all right. Boop. There we go. That was everything. We didn't really have that much, though. If you're not careful, you'll actually hit it as if you're you're falling rather than sliding. Eh, that wasn't even a setback. That just means I need to make this angle a little bit better. angle is going to be a little bit better um but i don't want to accidentally and when you do, when you walk up at this slow that means that's a steep angle so i knew that was uh i knew that was a possibility um let me i'm gonna More soil. Resin. More soil. What is that up there? That's another thing I'm going to figure out. like a glowing rock. Indeed. Indeed. I don't know if that necessarily means anything, though. Sometimes, um, sometimes that can actually be, um, something of, of worth. And sometimes it can just be nothing. Okay. I got a better angle. So, uh,
complete this so I don't get flying off the edge and die. <laughs> Just like that. go up real quick and see what that whoop it's gonna be one of those days eh let me go up real quick and see what that is oh that's just a different color oh wait the plan here you know and I had seen that I had just forgotten can we get tilt down on the cat cam and yeah, I'm trying to um you know what hold on let me try to <laughs> Cats are adorable, you know. <laughs> then, uh, we're going to walk over here to the pop coral. And we are going to explode the pop coral. <laughs> I figure, uh, <laughs> I figure the cat, the cat's face is probably better than, uh, <laughs> ooh, that's a lot of tech. Okay, I'll remember that because this is a flat surface. I can put a, um, I can put a, research thing right down here. There we go. I can, well, that's like perfectly flat too. I can put a research thing around here. I don't know to get rid of some of the debris, but that's fine. 355 for scanning means means that it's, it's a lot for actually researching. So I'm going to, uh, I'm gonna go up there and find out how much it is. I need to get aluminum, but I, I think aluminum is only in certain, certain planets. I thought it was on every planet, but I, I think it ends up, oh, you know what, I can check. I forgot they have a Wikipedia. Resources. How much height? This. What's aluminum? Laterite. Laterite. Oh yeah, found on all planets. Good. Good, good, good. And that's, uh... Hey, 
don't you guys go back to your own little platform? How about that? Titanium. <laughs> I actually want to save up and get a, uh, get a, um, one of those VTuber avatars. some picture from uh, Facebook 100 years ago. <laughs> okay. I do want you to make our job. I know that's going to be a power drain because that sucker requires a lot of power. Medium storage silo, large resource container, titanium alloy. Oh, titanium alloy makes a whole bunch of things. Okay, so yeah, we need titanium too. I should say as well. Probably pretty much the same, only with less hair. <laughs> I don't think that changed a lot. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Take a little woohoo! I'm gonna take a little zip around. There's just. Oh, okay, that's what I thought. Yeah, there's that horn. Um, there's also iron over there. changes things a little, because um, what I want to do now is get that exo, well, it's just garbage, what I want to do now is get that exo cache open. What? I'm going to do that by basically throwing it down this hill, and having it roll Having it 
get within range of one of these. And then walking over here. And then and boo boo, anything? Hello? Yeah, thank you. Hello, you still need to breathe. That's okay. Close enough to the base. Those exochips are very important. Trade platform. Tungsten, iron. Oh shit, I still wish I had that tungsten. can fill up and make. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna go down and try to find a aluminum because I do want to get that auto research thing going because that can be really important. Here we go. Let's see if we slip and die again. Woo! Down we go. Nope, see. There we are. research thing done because that this is uh this is a lot of research oh of course i forgot in order to do that i would need to uh a find find um that scared the crap out of me because it looked like a face for a second Aluminum and B actually be able to bring a uh, some sort of power source down here. <laughs> what does the uh, what are the power cells? So the wind battery extenders. Those require copper. So I would basically need to dedicate my RTG to uh, to that thing. And I don't feel like I want to do that. I just... uh, let's see what the upgraded drill would be. Drill mod 2. Tungsten carbine. Oh, crap. Diamond. Well, so here's what we're going to do. Okay, all those are done. Large shredder. Iron so there's glass, copper, aluminum. Yeah, I need to find aluminum. Large restores canister. Holds up to 400 nuggets. Oh, I need the medium resource canister. 32 nuggets of a single resource. Okay, first thing I want to do is get the auto extractor. Whoa, that was all my research points. <laughs> all right, I hope, uh, hope I enjoy that. There we go. Oh, you know, there was a research thing down here that was large that I want to grab, bring home. Oof. Be careful because I can still kill myself. This 
still kill myself if I bump wrong. I think it, it sliding has killed me more times than anything else in this game. I think I've suffocated like twice, but I've slid a bajillion friggin' times. Oh, you know what? I want to find the oasis, actually. I saw the oasis, and I can't remember. It was um, a little bit away from us. I want to find that. has a bunch of technology in it. That's what I want to bring. Sometimes the cat of things like to hide in these reed bunches, and it uh, it really screws your day up. <laughs> oh, and there's Argon. Really screws your day up when all of a sudden those things activate and whack you. Oh, steel. Oh, now there's something important. Okay, so. Feathers can go away. So we are definitely grabbing steel. We're sticking that to the side of the thing. Mm. Dynamite, less important. Solid fuel jump jet, less important. Um, Steel is very important, though. I'm glad I ran across this. Alright. I think that was... was beginning. My sister telling me about a labor maker that's cute. Internal supply. Or supply. Oh, I forgot that I only have these. But that's okay. Because uh, when the wind blows, these will work just as well as a. Uh, just as well. 
just as well as a uh, RPG. We just have to be patient. Come on, wind. <laughs> patience isn't necessarily my strong suit. Let's get going. I like the fact that they show that this thing has an oxygenator in it. I never noticed that before. They actually show that it's got a way to produce oxygen. How has the wind been down this long? little wind turn I've ever seen. Yeah, the one downside of having the bug is you can't just plug it in. Because otherwise I'd plug it directly in and then just attach the wind turbines to it. But, uh, there we go. again. <laughs> it was so exciting the first time. Here we go. My constant, uh, the constant excitement of this stream is what really sets me apart from other streamers. <laughs> it's just on the edge of your seats, I can imagine. I don't know if those are just plants. It might just be plants. I'm gonna grab that. Don't give me that crap. Oh, that's just really? I thought that was a research item. That looks so much like a research item. As we wait for the wind to blow once again. And it reminds me to check and see if one of the missions I completed gives me an RTG. So fast. Deposit resource to show your... Oh, okay. Create hydrazine and it will give me the thruster. I have to remember that, because usually... Medium gas canister. Oh, okay. Because usually I um I make the hydrazine thruster before I make the fuel. Anytime you're ready for the wind to blow, like is this a no wind zone? What's going on here? There we go. For a very long time, please. Until this thing pops open. to get a better webcam too so the people will see the cat better <laughs> I'll actually I might do that next paycheck get a really high end quality webcam
the problem with having cats that are all black is this you really only see uh, like a clump of black fur and you're just left to guess <laughs> what what it is where the head is thing in your top slot it will actually function it won't. the sun like the solar panel will function on any slot but the wind i think only functions in the top one all right we're gonna go down here we're gonna see okay so this is a mini mini oasis um one of the biomes that I was in had like a huge oasis and it was just massive and there was, it felt like a boss stage. Like, <laughs> ooh, refill internal power supply. It's hard to do that while the wind is kicking out. Why would you do that? How many things you attach? I think it only. It can only. Whoa! I didn't know there was a freaking balloon right there. Die! And there goes the research thing down the hill. <laughs> provide an awful lot of research. That's why I'm bothering to collect them. They provide... I don't know if they'll provide more than the other research we got. Oh, this is just a big old crash. Alright. Ah, <laughs> the tire just phased through. Tire just phased through the ground. <laughs> Oof. Didn't face through the present, though. I'm the most destructive driver I know. Oh, and that's gonna be a maintain. Maintain power. That's what I thought it was, this research thing. Which apparently is organic. Alright. <laughs> Thanks, I'm actually going to be getting off here in just a second, uh, so I appreciate it, but you don't have to. You may utilize your time and your computer for something else. Thank you for stopping by, and I'm sure I will see you later. If nothing else, uh, the fact that you want to continue to watch my cat. <laughs> nothing else but the fact that the cat is the focal point of, uh, <laughs> of this whole thing. That's okay. 
Uh, come for the game, watch the cat. That's totally fine. I am not against that at all. Ooh, good. Extenders. But there's literally nothing in here that I can get rid of. For those. So I'll just have to find those later. <laughs> have a good one. Cells, nothing of any importance. Let's go this way. Hey, what? Um, trying to drive a tractor through this train is kind of sketchy, but, um, Buggy is actually pretty much at home. At home on this uh, this range. Mm -hmm. Okay, that way is our house. So why don't we go? over there. <laughs> Maybe I can fly to it. I believe I can fly. Oh crap. I was wrong. <laughs> I didn't want to jump out. I wanted to flip the buggy. <laughs> items. By the way, if you haven't noticed that you, you never catch me with any of those one time use items. I don't, um... I don't like spending materials. <laughs> like... I don't like spending materials. And so it, it feels like a waste for me to, uh, so we go over here, look at the fog horn. Again, my favorite part is the fact that, like, the story here is somebody put one of those on their rover, drove it out to the middle of nowhere, and the rover crashed. And they were like, oh, no, I gotta leave my foghorn behind. <laughs> like, that's just funny to me that, uh... That idea that anyone would do that, just take an entire rover... my own roads. Like... I don't know. 
house is actually on top of this hill. It's to our left here. So. Oh, what was that? Oh, it's a little valley. Oh, here is the biome I was talking about. That was near us. Um, okay, so. Yeah. Scrap. Oh, aluminum, titanium alloy. Um, okay. that there. Titanium alloy. We're putting that there. I am... Um, okay. This is what we're doing. We're sticking all this there. Sticking these there. I'm grabbing that because I can get. I can make those in a minute. All right. Here's the biome I was talking about. That is, it's like um, I um, like Earth has has heat vents in the bottom of the ocean, and this is uh, wah! this is very much like um, that if it were underwater. Um, but also, most importantly, this one has just random holes that go to the middle of the earth. <laughs> and so you do have to be very careful. Oh, there's more aluminum. Oh, that's good to know. There's a bunch of angry plants. You do have to be very careful when you're driving around. Because, that's what I can see that, there's just a hole. There's just everything here. I should have seen if I could land in here. It's got everything. It's got clay. It's got... Research. It's got holes to the center of the earth. Look how deep that goes. Like, this just... I should look at actually making those beacons. What is this? Glacio. 1742 north. 4.41 west. Minus 1.09 meters. This is, um, Put hot zone because I can't remember what they're actually called. But uh, this is the Australian ones. Okay, so that didn't. Who feels like an idiot? This guy, this guy. Okay. And what we're gonna do? Pop out of here. We're gonna do it the old-fashioned way. If the wind would stop blowing right in my face.
driving. <laughs> okay, so first thing we're doing is dropping off. Next thing we're doing. Did I already fill the last section or did I say I had a section I could fill? I had a section. System. Oh, look at all that argon. Okay. The next thing. Oh, it could only do argon. Okay. All right. Well, look at that all. All that argon. <laughs> We're bringing that all home. what we're gonna do. I'm in there so it saves the game. Exit. And then I'm going to duplicate. To duplicate this. I'm gonna say SP whoops. SP stream test two. Because we're still trying to figure out a gas canister or anything like that I want to It's a good thing I have an aluminum with me. <laughs> the launch in the midair. I thought it was actually going to let me go to a different planet. It is not. But I do know I have a landing pad, so I'm waiting for that to show up. Which I swore was over there. Time you're ready now. Sometimes it's hard to see the uh, GPS thing. No, I'm pretty sure that this is it, and it's just not showing me the um. It's just not showing me the uh. Beacon. That's it or this is it. Um, you know what? Here we go. I know we're near one. So it's, uh, yep. <laughs> this is walking across the entire planet. With 
They're freaking, uh... Oh. Oh, yeah, I think I did actually land on the wrong. I think, uh... Yeah. I think we're up here. <laughs> but I don't know why it didn't show my, uh... My landing pad. Here we are. Again. I don't know why I didn't show my landing pad this time. Something happened like. It's okay. I'm glad I glad I guessed. There was a modium near us. Is that? No, that's present. Oh, it was near the um, compound. Oh, I remember it was near the compound. It's a good thing. I wanted to once again say it's a good thing for the developers. Recognize that you may get stranded on um, any of the planets, and so they made it so that you could. Um... You know what? Why don't I just go back and get my solar canisters? Because they're actually uh, they're pretty close by. Where is that? Pretty close by, I remember. No, it was the. Oh crap! Excuse me while I pee a little. <laughs> that was terrifying. Um, yeah, it was, uh, it was right down here. By the way. What the heck is that? Oh, that's a horn too. Look at all these freaking horns. Oh, there's some right there. Um, I thought I don't fall down the hole. Oh, yeah, okay, so here we go. <laughs> Oop. <laughs> I thought that, um, That's a really long way to go for no reason, though. so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go where there was ammonium um, on, the, on the way down here. And I'm just going to go pick, whoops, I don't know what that driving is. Woo! <laughs> Come on, I've done it a hundred times. Yeah, and I'm just going to go get some of that. It's present. It's over here somewhere. I think it's on top of the uh
What's in here? Couldn't see the, uh... You know... Drive. I don't know if I ever mentioned that before. <laughs> and there's a real good reason for it. And you're looking at it. Okay. The thing is, I get angry and I'm just gonna have to kind of get over its issues. take some of those beacons with me next time so that I actually have, uh, I have something I can just set down. That is special. What is going on here? Drop it! <laughs> Drop it! Like, what is, what is this? Okay. All right, so the last thing we are going to do today, put those where they need to go, like that. I'm going to make, ugh. we have a lot of exos chips. I did not realize that. We have a ton of them. I mean, they're good, but holy crap. Okay. Last thing we're going to do is make a... Um, unlock. Seven thousand. That's how much that dang thing is making. You're going to make a... atmospheric condenser and we are going to make a hydrazine and there's some plastic plastic is carbon compound and then we are going to switch that thala bleh, solid thruster with a hydrazine one Did it say? Yeah, iron, glass, and plastic. And then we are going to get started on. Uh... Oh, these are the. Which one are you? Atmosphere condenser. Can cans is no longer in camera frame. <laughs> so 
we will fix that. Just wait for this, because I want it to make. I'm going to go to hydrazine, which is ammonium and ammonium. Which means while we're doing that, I'm going to go down here and do some more digging. takes two, two soil canisters. So that means we need four soil canisters. Oh, I forgot I had the tungsten alloy thing on me. Four canisters full. So. But he's doing that ridiculous can. Stop digging. Test is think the thing's gonna kick on while he's there because it's a titanium alloy that's actually that is more difficult to make. Hydrogen in the morning, yeah. Hydrogen. So, give me some hydrogen. Against five, because I know I'm going to be making a ton more of this stuff eventually. Grinds to a halt because that takes 20 energy a second. Oh, hey, who wants to see? <laughs> who wants to see an extreme close up of the side of Kenny's face? Inspect his ear for me, see if it looks good. <laughs> hmm. <laughs> There's the 
those two. Auto extractor. That's what, uh, Soil, and you've got your hydrogen thing right there. Great hydrogen. Which means we can. for thought. And the next thing was what? Critical thinking. Oh, find a vehicle data recording on Vecinia. Got it. Pull you off. We're gonna put you on. And now, we can take trips wherever we want. Has eight launches compared to the two <laughs> that this solid fuel one gave us. All right, so thank you all for joining me today. A lot of people joined. It was wonderful. It was a lot of fun. I like talking to people and playing the game. Alright, thanks again everybody, and I will see you a different time, probably, maybe tomorrow morning, I don't know if I wake up early enough, <laughs> bye bye!